Hello guys and welcome back to our channel. If you haven't subscribed, please do so and join the family. Don't forget to like and share our videos. Today, we shall be reviewing 15 effective tips to optimize images for SEO. For most bloggers, images only pick up text and improve user experience. However, those pictures can do more. You can use them to enhance your website's search engine ranking. In other words, optimizing your images for SEO improves the chances of readers finding your blog when looking for related videos. Here, we shall review 15 practical tips to help you optimize your images for SEO. From using a web-friendly file format to adding alt text. You will learn several ways to improve your website chances of ranking high in search results. What is Image SEO? Image SEO is a great way to attract organic traffic. It refers to optimizing images on a blog to improve the site's visibility. You can set up Image SEO by optimizing image size and incorporating file names and alt tags. Optimizing images helps search engines understand the content of the photo, which enables them to be ranked appropriately. SERPs Simply put, Image SEO assists search engines in indexing and displaying image search results correctly. You may ask, why are these images important for SEO? By now, you should know that image SEO is a vital part of blogging because it helps your site rank higher on the search ladder. For a better understanding, here are a few reasons why images are essential for SEO. 1. It improves user experience. 2. It helps in increased visibility. 3. It helps in image ranking. Having said all that, let us now look at the effective tips to optimize images for SEO rather than wildly used ones. Hence, if you utilize the same stock photos that other blogs use, chances are that your site won't rank high on the pages. You can get unique images for your blog by creating your own or finding less popular stock photos. Here are a few tips for finding unique images. See photos that are less popular using a reverse image search engine. Find and use niche specific images. Create your pictures by contacting photographers or artists to help you. 2. Never replace text with images. One word of advice, never replace text with images. If you do, you only hurt your blog, since search engines can't read pictures. When you replace text with images, search engines assume your content is vital and treat it as such. If you don't want that to happen, follow the tips for using images to supplement text. One. Use images to break up text and add visual appeal to your content. For how-to posts, use images to illustrate and bolster your points. Use images to add content and help readers understand the content better. 3. Use a web-friendly file format. There are several image file formats available, however, not all of them are web friendly. You should be mindful of what type of file formats you are uploading to your blog. File formats like JPEG and PNG are good options as they are smaller and load faster than others. Here are the best file formats for blogs. JPEG, they are the perfect formats for photographs. PNG, these file formats can be used if you want to upload pictures with sharp edges like photos and icons. They make better choices. 
GIF If you are going for animated images, GIFs are your best bet. Number 4 Use SEO friendly image dimensions Image dimensions are crucial factors to consider when uploading images to your blog. They can, however, affect how images are displayed on your site and how search engines index it. Although the correct image dimensions depend on your website's layout and picture size, there are still some general rules to follow. 1200 by 630 pixels For blog posts and articles, use images with these options or smaller. 2048 by 1536 pixels if yours is a product page use this option or larger images 1920 by 1080 pixels pictures that are this size or larger are ideal for header images 5 Reduce the image size to 150 kilobytes or less. Large images will load slower than small sized images. The larger the picture, the slower your website's loading speed. And as you know, a slow website is a recipe for failure as it will lead your users abandoning your site after waiting a few seconds. Hence, you must ensure to optimize and resize your images before uploading. Here are a few tips to help you. 1. Reduce the images. Reduce the size of your images using all paid online compression tools. There are many tools online, but choose one that considerably retains the image's quality. Upload. After compressing your images, you can then upload them to your site. Remember to specify the correct file format and dimensions before uploading. Number 6. Lazy load images on your website. Lazy loading is a technique employed by website owners to defer the loading of images until they are visible. This image SEO strategy helps to improve your blog's loading speed, user experience, and search engine ranking. Follow the steps below to implement these tips. Use a lazy loading plugin or script. Download a lazy loading plugin. Many paid and free lazy loading plugins exist for content management systems like WordPress or Shopify. Find one that best suits your needs. Install and configure. The next thing you want to do is to download the script or plugin. Afterwards, configure it to lazy load all the images or website by clicking a few options. Number 7. Give your images an SEO-friendly file name. Naming your images may seem like a minor deal, but it is essential to image SEO. The file name you give your photo can affect how search engines index it. When naming your image files, you must be as descriptive as possible. Below are a few things to include when naming your images. The subject of the image, relevant keywords, a file extension that states the image format. Let's say your image is about a dog playing fetch. You should name the file thus, dog playing fetch, jpg. You can see that this example includes the subject of the image, the dog, the keywords, dog, playing, fetch, and the file extension, jpg. Number 8. Add a relevant and descriptive ALT tag. Alt tags are text alternatives to images. They improve the accessibility of your website for visually impaired and improve search engine indexing. Typically, these texts should be at most 150 characters as anything more will be difficult to read. To do this, Follow the steps below. Open the HTML file where the image is. Find the image tag and add the alt attributes to it. The tag should appear like this. Set the value of the alt attributes to a descriptive text. Number 9. 
add background images to your website's CSS. The ground images can improve your SEO while adding visual interest and branding to your site. Besides making your website easier to scan, it can also help specify the background image's size, position, and repeat. If you want to add a background image to your website CSS, follow the steps below. Open your website CSS file. Find the selector for the element where you want to add the background image. Set the value of the background image property to the URL of your chosen photo. Number 10. Mark up your images with structured data. Marking up your images with structured data will help search engines understand your content and rank your website higher in search results. Additionally, it helps to enhance user experience, providing more information about your content to your audience. Here are the most common types of structured data that you can use to mark up your images. Image objects. This structured data provides the title, alt text, and description of an image. Products. This also provides information about a product price, availability, and reviews. Recipe. The recipe structured data details a recipe's ingredients, instructions, and additional information. 11. Use a catching solution to deliver images quicker. Storing copies of your website images on a close-by server is called a catching solution. Tools like Cloudflare, CloudFront, and Vanish are caching solutions that you can use to improve your image SEO and website loading speed. To use a caching solution, add a few lines of code to your website's code. Your caching solution would automatically Store copies of your website images on the cloud. 12. Keep your images up to date. As timing trends change, your images can quickly and easily become outdated. An obsolete photo on your blog can make it look tacky and out of style. Worst of all, outdated images can also hurt your SEO. For these reasons, you must keep your photos up to date with the following tips. Regularly review your images. Replace outdated images. Optimize. 13. Avoid keyword stuffing, image titles, and alt tags. You must resist the urge to keyword stuff when writing your image titles, descriptions, and alt tags. This practice is the act of using excessive or irrelevant keywords in a bid to rank higher on SERPs. Unfortunately, doing this will only backfire as it leads to getting penalized by Google. Here are some tips for writing compelling image titles and alt tags that do not break the law. Use natural language. Focus on writing a descriptive and accurate alt tag. Avoid keyword stuffing. Use keywords relevant to the image and content, keeping it as brief as possible. Number 14. Use image sitemap. Image sitemaps are vital tools that help to communicate your image description to search engines. Image sitemap tools like Google Search Console or Yoast SEO will help to improve your website ranking in search results. When using an image sitemap, here are a few things to remember. Image sitemaps must be in XML format. They must include the following information for each image. Image URL, image title, image alt text, image file size, image dimensions, and image date. And lastly, at number 15, using hyphens instead of underscores. Consider using hyphens instead of underscores to make your image file names more readable to search engines. Why, you may ask, it all boils down to search engine algorithms. They interpret hyphens as spaces and underscores as word separators. For instance, the file name Cute Puppies JPG would be interpreted by Google as cutepuppies.jpg, which is not readable. For instance, the file name, quote, 
cute underscore puppies dot jpg quotes would be interpreted by Google as cute puppies dot jpg, which is not readable. When you use quotes cute underscore puppies dot jpg instead, this is more readable for search engines and humans. Remember, optimizing images for SEO as you upload them on your blog is a vital ingredient for success. The more optimized your pictures are, the higher the rank on Google search engine. By following the tips outlined in this video, you can improve the visibility of your images, drive traffic to your blog, and improve your website's overall SEO ranking. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do not forget to leave us a like rating below and be sure to lay your concerns in the comment section below. And I will see you in our next video.